I would like to extend our sincere and heartfelt condolences to the family and friends. And I can also promise the vigorous and judicious pursuit of justice in this case. And I can now announce that as of this afternoon, we now have a warrant for the arrest of Ryan Alexander Jenkins for the murder of Jasmine. Last night, officers from the Blaine Police Department in the state of Washington recovered one of the vehicles that we had previously announced. That vehicle is the black 2003 BMW X5. The white 2007 Mercedes-Benz CLS 550 with paper plates is still outstanding and we continue to ask the public's support and uh, assistance in locating that vehicle. At this time, it is our belief that the suspect has crossed the border into Canada, and we are currently working with the Royal Canadian Mounted Police in our attempts to locate him. Last night, the black BMW was located in the city of Blaine, Washington, with a boat trailer attached. Later, a boat, which is owned by Ryan Jenkins, was located in Port Robert in the state of Washington. At this time, while we believe he has crossed into Canada, we're not 100% sure of that. Um, and there will be no uh, stone unturned, and we will look under every rock for him. There's a lot out on the internet. You can read all about it. There's, there's, a, there's a lot that's not true. And there's a lot that's, that's not true. She was. Um, yeah, we can't talk. Um, Jasmine was a, was a beautiful person. She uh, um, was a very caring individual. Um, she loved her family and friends. And uh, a lot of the information that you're seeing in the news is not true. Um, uh, we had a very uh, close relationship for a long time, and she is just a beautiful person. Uh, this message goes out to the family uh, his mother and father, and to the friends that are helping him try to leave this country. Uh, Ryan Jen Jenkins is an animal. Um, what he has done to Jasmine is uh, unspeakable. Um, it's just not right. And I appreciate your help. Um, please understand who you are helping leave this country. And. We ask for your support to, uh, to bring Ryan um, to custody. Your question was about mutilation? Yes, we're prepared to answer that question at this time. Yes, the, the fingers and teeth were removed. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm sorry, sir, say again. <laughs> well, that's an ongoing investigation. I can't comment on that right now. <laughs> It can be inferred that way. Um, we had to tell the family today, a lot of the information also was already getting out in the press and the public. And uh, what we're calling upon too is to uh, ask for help from the public. They've been great, uh, both Canadian and US. If you have anything to add, we still have that wee tip line up and running and it's manned. And uh, as you can say, see, it was very uh, traumatic for the family and they'd have to inform them that uh, horrific detail.